All right, so in order to do the um, butter knife, the first step we want to do is trace the pattern onto a blank. So this is the pattern. You're going to place it carefully on the blank and hold it down. While you're holding it down, carefully trace around the outline, taking your time to do it right. You might need somebody to help you hold it. So I've got to switch hands here. And so we've got the pattern traced and we'll go on to the next step. So the next step in making the butter knife is to use a spoke shave to cut down remove material till we get to the outline of the butter knife. And when you're using the spoke shave, you always want to cut in a in the downhill direction. And what I mean by that is that the top of the hill on this would be, and there's a couple of them, right there. It's the highest point on the, on the edge of the butter knife. We've got another one over here. So cutting in a downhill direction means I'm cutting this way on this side of the hill, and on this side I'm cutting this way Here's the bottom of the hill, so we're always cutting this way and that way, or that way. Okay, and what it's going to look like, so what that means is you take the spoke shave and you, there's the blade right here, and it cuts in this direction toward the, the cap, so I would cut this way. This is going downhill on this side, and to cut this way, to cut downhill over here, I have to turn this around and cut that way. Okay, so I'll, uh, I'll get this set in a vise and I'll show you how that's actually gonna look when we do it. Okay, in order to now shape it with the spoke shave, it's gonna look like this. So here's the top of the hill that we talked about, and I'm gonna, I'm gonna start removing material. I have more to remove here, so I'm gonna start there. And I'll just start cutting in the downhill direction because it cuts this way. If I turned it this way, I wouldn't want to do that because I'd be cutting uphill. Now here I can do that because this is going downhill. So I'm going to turn it this way and go downhill. And then I went to the bottom of the hill and I want to go downhill here again. When I get to the bottom. So you're just going to continue on doing cutting downhill, watching your line, being careful. You don't go too far. That's what the line's there for. You gotta watch it. It's cutting downhill. And like I said, there's more to take off here. So I'm not gonna start right here. I wanna work up here a little bit and kind of work my way back so I can take most of this material off. I'm just using the spoke shave. Now, one other pointer, if you're pressing, if, don't press too hard. If you're pressing so hard that it moves like that, you're using too much pressure. All you want to do is just basically the weight of the, the weight of the uh, spoke shave is plenty. And tighten up a little bit. Maybe the weight of the spoke shave plus the weight of your hands. So I'm not like, I'm not resting my whole body on it. I'm just using, holding the spoke shave and using it, not pressing down too hard. All right. And that's